Hello everybody. So today I want to talk about calculus. The topic that is about differential equations. So now I want to show you how to answer. We see that this is about number zero. That means in this situation, we just find only complementary solutions. So I will put about yc equals to e to the power of lambda s. Later that we need to do first derivative of yc and we have lambda e to the power of lambda s. So when we do first derivative of this one, we keep the same e to the power of lambda s. Later that, we need to do first derivative of lambda s. You got lambda. And now we go to second, third, and fourth of derivative. So that should be like this. So we have this equation. Now I will put this one going here, this one going here, this one going here, this one going here, and this one going here. And now we have like this. So we have e to the power of lambda x. We can do about factorization. And now we need to find the solution of this one. Now, in this situation, we can do about factorization of this one. Lambda minus number two everything to the power of 3 multiplied by lambda plus 1. So in this situation, we can see that we have the power number 3. That means we have 3 lambda equals to number 2 when we find the solutions. And now we can get the final answer. That is about y equals to c number y c. That is about c number one e to the power of lambda s. Now we put number two going here. So because they repeat the solutions again, so that means for c number two. We multiply by s e to the power of 2s. C number 3, that is about s square e to the power of 2s. So if we have another solution, we need to increase the power s. And the last one, that is about c number 4 e to the power of negative s. This is the end. Thank you for watching.